hey everybody and welcome back to our channel in today's video we are going to show you how to add your initials here in adobe acrobat let's begin now the first thing that you need to do is to log in using your credentials if this is your first time in adobe acrobat i want you to click the sign up option and from here just follow the on-screen instructions and you're good to go Adding your initials to a PDF or any document in Adobe Acrobat can be done using the Fill In Sign tool. Once you are logged in to your Adobe Acrobat using the web version, I want you to hover to the e Sign section, wherein you can simply use the Fill In Sign, complete the form, and add your signature. Okay, click this option right here, and it would ask for you to select a file. You can drag and drop a PDF, and then fill in sign it. Let's do that. Here you have a drop down menu. You can go for the most recent from documents from your computer or another storage account. We're going to the from documents and I have a recent file here. Click on continue. What will happen is we would be forwarded to this section right here to add an initial. The initial is in the left hand panel of your dashboard. You see this right here? Go next, click on next, get started. You see this? edit your initials all right so we have a separate video on how to add your initials here now all you're going to do is you have three options at the top you can type in your initials for example um adobe for example adobe X acrobat that's going to be aa you can type your initials above that's one way click and save and you have this and if you click on that you would be able to put your initials here all right, so that's that. You see this? Of course, you can make it a little bit bigger. Make it a different font color. You have all these options for you. For example, that. Now, if you want to edit your initials using a draw, you can also do that. For example, we're going to be using maybe Adobe Express, right? Uh, I mean, Adobe uh, Acrobat. Adobe Acrobat as a drawing. All right, so for example, that. Click on save. Now you can drag this again here. Right? Drag this. The initials. And that's that. Another option is click on the editor initials. Now, if you want to use a specific image, for example, you have chosen a different initials using a picture. Click the select image and click on save and you would be able to drag and drop the initials in your canvas. All right. Basically, your initials can act as a signature or personal marker to authenticate your approval or involvement in the document. You can also do this in the Adobe Acrobat application. You see, again, all I have to do is go to the more option here there is an option for the fill in sign because earlier we we're using the Adobe Acrobat web version. This time, it's going to be the desktop application or your computer application. Again, all you're going to do is click this. You see that? Obviously, you can put as many as initials as you can here because initializing every page or specific section of a contract to signify agreement are here to indicate review or approval of specific pages or sections all right and that's it for today's video thank you so much for watching we will see you again in the next one